Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel Quick Solvers. Here we want to find f of x where f of 2 times x minus 3 equals 4 times x squared minus 14 times x plus 13. This is a very good question for you if you are preparing for SAT or ACT and its difficulty level is medium as is shown by this color here. Okay, let's dive in. The first step I will set this expression to be equal to t. So t equals 2 times x minus 3. So I can conclude that x equals t plus 3 over 2. And then in the second step, I will replace every x that I have in this expression by its equivalent, t plus 3 over 2. And we know that this is t. So I can write this as f of t, I'm, I'm rewriting this, okay? So f of t equals 4 times t x squared, which is t plus 3 over 2 squared, minus 14 times x, which is t plus 3 over 2 plus 13, okay? Now I need to expand this expression here and also expand this expression here and add everything up together so we're done all right so let's see if i want to expand this one let's see what we get well i'll write it here four times t plus three over two squared equals four times t squared plus 6 times t plus 9 over 4 and this 4 and this 4 cancel out each other and what is left is t squared plus 60 plus 9 so I can rewrite this let me it's a different color f of t equals for the first term we have t squared plus 60 plus 9 now it's time to expand or distribute this 14 to this term here so let me get rid of this we don't need them anymore so we have 14 times t plus 3 over 2 which leaves us with well these two leaves us with 7 so we would have 7 times t plus 21 okay so if i continue writing this well, this equals 7 times t plus 21, and then we have this 13. If we add up everything here together, then we can write it as f of t equals t squared. This 60 and minus 70 leaves us with um, minus t. And then we have 9 minus 21 and plus 13. 9 plus 13 is 22. Minus 21 is 1. So this is f of t. f of t equals t squared minus t plus 1. But we were looking for f of x. Okay. So we can say f of x. When we have f of t, then finding f of x is just replacing t by x f of x is x squared minus x plus 1 and now we are 